The funny thing about this American Idol experience is that one second I'm at home, I'm in high school, and I'm kind of the quiet guy who all the girls feel safe around, uh, the, just the nice guy, and um, suddenly here I am at Idol, and now I'm getting literally hundreds of emails from like these 12, 13-year-old girls saying, oh, you're so cute, you're so cute. And uh, even the girls on the show here, they all think I'm just adorable for some reason. He's just so cute, you just want to take him home. You just want to pinch his cheeks. It's kind of like I'm a sex symbol now. I kind of like it. Go let him pinch your cheeks. Hey, ladies, how's it going? Hey, hey, I bet you're wondering how I knew About your plans to make me through With some other guy that you knew before Between the two of us guys, you know I loved you more It took me by surprise <laughs> I really thoroughly enjoyed that. I mean, you know what's great? You're here because not only are you funny and you're cool, and I like Ryan calling you the gangster and all that. Because you know, you're in the dog pound too, right, ladies? He's in the dog pound. <laughs> but you can actually sing, man. I heard you singing a little run at the end. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was, I was like, yo. I was like, yo. I was like, yo, man, America, don't forget, my boy can blow too. Good job. Good Thank job, you. baby. Thank you. Good job. Infectious. You are infectious. I can't, it's like immediately, every, I look around, everyone is just smiling from ear to ear. I think you're the next sex symbol. Can I say? <laughs> I just love your performance. I, I just, you're having a blast and I love watching your parents. <laughs> you're having a blast. You're just adorable. Thank you. And it was a good performance. Thank you very much. He's a good time, man. Kyle, you gotta give it up to him. He's a good time, This man. really is la-la land, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Look, I mean, Kevin, I mean, come on. Uh, I do like you. Okay. And I think you are, a, you know, you're, you're likeable. But the reality is if I heard that on the radio, I'd turn it off. Oh, that's so true. I would. I would. I would. But this is sort of a backhanded compliment. Uh, because I do like you, yeah, and I okay. think lots of other people will like you, but I'm just trying to put a tiny bit of reality back into the show here, which is, as a singing competition, <laughs> wasn't the best version of I've Heard It Through the Grapevine I've ever heard. No, but he was right. great. Did he even sing runs? He was all right, man. And he was singing. And Kevin Colbert. <laughs> well, it seemed like you had fun, and that's what you I wanted to do. I had a great time. You know, Kevin, it's funny that you should mention your status with the ladies because you do have uh, film star looks, and I've discovered your Hollywood body double. Ladies and gentlemen, take a look. <laughs> Chicken Little. Just to let you in on a secret, Paris Bennett over here calls Kev Chicken Little and does this little <laughs> dance. Love you, every Paris. Now and then. Now, is that what you say? You do the dance, you say. Well, after all this attention, he's chicken large now, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, yeah. Let's try to help you out, brother. Thank you. 
If you want to vote for Kev, 1-866-IDLE-05, 1-866-436-5705, or you can text the word VOTE to 5705. Good luck, man. Thank you. Thank you very much. We appreciate it. Smiles all over the studio after that. Stay with us. Coming up.